we're gonna do a short unboxing video. Everybody, this is Ernie. Ernie, this is. Well, you're gonna be on the news to everybody, but I promise people are gonna like you. Yeah, it's the rug I had to roll up because you might be on it. He's a good boy. Obviously, gets into everything as puppies tend to do. Well, I placed my. Uh, I had a. I had one color changing bulb, LED bulb. And so. It sold me on the idea of having a, uh, a bulb that you can control the the color and the intensity of, especially by remote. That's that's pretty cool. So let's open this up. But before we do, yeah, let's check out what we got here. So this says this lunar contains built-in LED lamps. The lamps cannot be changed in the luminaire, so I guess the luminaire is the housing. You have to throw it away. I guess it's partially recyclable. Oh, for any of you returning visitors, my thumb, my thumb is nearly completely healed. Actually, I'll probably cut that little bit off today. <laughs> it's weird. Finally made it. I think it took to go because I originally just whacked my my thumb on a uh, it was like on a brake caliper trying to fix Molly's brakes. Not handy, but uh, you could tell I was all thumbs that day. Anyways, it's almost almost healed. So, but that's not why you clicked on this video to hear me talk about my healing thumb. It did take about two months though, just FYI. <laughs> now the remote, the remote has, here's all its technical specifications. It's a nine watt bulb. Luminous flux is 950. Multicolor and white base. E26 is what they call a standard light bulb base. Hmm. At least here in the US. In the US. It's pretty cool. It's um, receptive to a wide range of alternating current voltage. So I think it's, it's 110 to 120 over here in the states but in Europe I forget what you guys are over there you're like are you 220 I think you guys might all be 220 over there it's just what we use for our washer and dryer big um, big appliances in our stoves if they're electric so anyways here's the Customer service, 24 hours service email. This is definitely from China. So, either way, I don't really mind as long as it's a good product. Dual purpose, dual packaged. We have two of them in here. It really is mood lighting too. That's what I love about it. You know, when I'm in the, I mean, like a, like a late night focused. Sometimes when I'm filming, actually, I'll put on the red light. Um, the blue light seems to be more stimulating. It's like a, and it technically is a higher energy. It's a shorter wavelength, higher frequency. So. 
might be a placebo effect, but to me, the, the different colors do kind of go with, uh, with different moods for me. Lighting, dimming function, color, meant to replace a 75 watt bulb. Alright, I think I've wasted as much time as I can without opening the box. Let's... <coughs> I am going to need to use this. I'm sure it'll come with a little packaging and instructions. But, uh, we got a couple different functions. Flash, timer, four popular, smooth. Um, maybe those are colors. A strobe effect. For the, uh, the raves me and Ernie are gonna have. <laughs> Hi, boy. He's actually being, he was being real, uh, real hyper, full of beans this morning, so the fact that he's calmed down, I'm gonna let him, I'm gonna try to let him ride that out, <laughs> so I'm not gonna disturb him. Let's find out what's in this box. Insert seven. Insert the Brad Pitt meme right there. Let's do it. Okay. So we'll get in from here. looking coffee out of the picture. I don't know why my coffee looks so sludgy all the time. It's weird. Okay. Here we go. Get a knife. I forgot that four came in here. That's really cool. Fantastic. And if this was a legit review, I wouldn't be too impressed with the instructions being folded like that and just wedged in there. But it was extremely cheap. So, I'm not complaining. Practical Color Series. A red, green, blue, white LED bulb light by Yang CSL. This is the 
single page user manual here. Timer on the right, on the left here, it's all the buttons. 50 to 60 hertz. I guess anything that's. Oh, okay, I see you. I see you. Oh boy, we'll play in a minute. We'll play. Anything less than anything that flashes. Any alternating current less than 60 hertz is noticeable to the human eye. So we've noticed a flickering at 40 hertz, which is why all alternating current is around. I think in Europe it's 50 hertz, and over here it's 60 hertz. So, dimming, general lighting strobe, press any of the fixed preset color buttons. The unit will change to the color. Ooh, and then you got <laughs> warm mode, fresh mode, and romantic mode. Over here, <laughs> with the pink and purple. That's funny. Fresh, as we can see, fresh is green. And warm is red. Red and green. Cool. Alright, let's try one out. this and we get better lighting on the light bulb and that was not better here we go it's a little bit better so um, it's actually a pretty pretty nice sleek smooth design as advertised. Doesn't have the Yang CSL. Or no it does, okay. They added some more specs on it there, below the logo. It's a nice texture. is clearly it's just a uh, plastic but this is I guess this is also a plastic it almost feels like ceramic so very cool Here's our light bulb. Oh, that's hot. It's been on for a minute. Got a little rag here to shield me, insulate the heat. Let's 
test this out. cycle. Whoa, what is that? Interesting. Look what it's doing to the camera. In real life, all these colors are solid. The flicker is just an artifact on the camera. I guess it's the frame rate at which this camera is taking pictures is uh, making it look offset. That's, that's really cool. Very interesting. That's a cool color though, I like that. Well, that's, that's pure red, that's pure green. Blue, and then this next one is orange. No, it's like a, it's like a red, yellow. I like it. Very cool. And purple. Purple is solid. That's pink, it's like a hot pink. The red, green, and blue are the primary colors. So that's, I wonder if that's why they don't flicker, because they're not combinations of colors. They're just pure, pure, um, I guess they're individual LEDs with specifically either red, green, or blue um, functionality. I don't know how to say that. So interesting. There we go. Let's get our remotes out. It's on the middle. They got a wedge. They got a nice little cardboard cutout slot for each bowl being the remote. And we just pull this. Let's pull it out. What do you think, Ernie? It's not one to go. I feel like it's going to be loud. Oh, it's stuck to it with a, an adhesive. Let me just do this off camera real quick. Alright. sounds uh, these remote makes these remotes make great sounds I love the the kind of insulated soft plastic that they use oh my god they better not be trying to say smart that would be too funny s-a-m-r-t <laughs> They did not misspell that. Samert light. I really feel like they were going for the word smart right there. Wow. I wonder why that's... Maybe if that's why uh, they're so cheap. Does it say smart light anywhere on it? It does. Look at that. It's meant to say smart. That is... <laughs> It's too funny. A Samurai light. Oh man. Oh 
wonder if that guy was fired who made that that decision. I wonder if that was a um, obviously not a top down because because the design so it wasn't the designer's fault. I wonder if that was the like if they did a test batch and someone okayed that or if it was just purely the the machinists whoever programmed that in to be printed like that I wonder if it was if, I wonder if that was their fault <laughs> that would be funny alright so let's pull this out and there we go now we're gonna so the battery, that little tab was insulating the battery from making a connection with the circuit. So now the battery is connected to the circuit. The juices are flown, or the electrons, I should say. Let's go with... Zero, 01 or open closed current. What does this F do? It's a function key. Let's turn it on. Cycling through to Whoa, that's a strobe light. That was unintended. Oh my god. There we go. Okay, cool. So that's that's actually a really nice like a warm color white for an LED. I really, I really like that. Um, let's see what, what does, what does this one do? That's red. Alright, so that makes sense. That's, so that's gonna cycle through discreetly discrete colors and I'm gonna guess because it shows here on the button that these are all right there they're all distinct here let me put the white on again these are all distinct little blobs when I go to this one they're all smeared in together I'm going to guess this is a smooth transition. Yeah, that's what it is. Look at that, and it's, I love, I love how the camera artifact pulses. It, uh, it ebbs and flows as the, uh, as the colors transition. Very cool. Alright, let's put on let's put on the mood. Let's try the three different mood lightings now. Let's do warm. Let's make it nice and warm in here for Ernie. He is he is one hundred percent conked out right now. Look at him. Oh boy. Good boy. <laughs> Alright. So that's... That's the... What mood was that supposed to be again?
Yeah, that was warm mode, and then we have fresh mode and romantic. Romantic mode. So that's warm. Yeah, so again, you can't really get the real feel for it on the camera with all these artifactual flickerings. But that's, it's going from red to yellow. And in between, it's that real, obviously, red-yellow fusion. But it's, it's like a, it hits like a coral, like a coral color right there. I actually really like that. That's nice. All right, then fresh mode. It's gonna be bouncing from green to blue, I'd say. Yeah, there we go. It's like a, it's like a light blue. It's actually really nice. You'd almost say it's kind of sammered. How they coded that. <laughs> All right, and then last but certainly not least is romantic mode and that of course is the the very traditional pink and purple 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 solid colors now. Blue. Here's orange, I guess. Nice. And here's teal. Maybe like a blue-green. Aqua, maybe it's called. Oh, there we go. That kind of helps to stabilize it a little bit. He looks like he's running. He played really, really, really hard with his cousins yesterday. They're in German short hair pointers. So they are fast, fast dogs. And they're full grown, but they had way more energy than he did. So it was really good for me and Molly <laughs> for him to be conked out. He was worn out. And I got my friend Jillian coming over with her, her pit bull. Um, I think he's a mix named Ryder. You guys have, if you uh, looked at my IG, he's on my Instagram. I took him, I took him for a walk a couple, a couple weeks ago, I think. Wow, look at him. Wake up, buddy. You're a little roadie, huh? You a music boy? That guitar is going to be yanked down as soon as he wakes up and gets up. How does he even do that? How, how is that even possible? Okay. 
I guess that was pretty much it, other than that's blue, the last three colors. Alright, yellow. It's a, it's a pretty perfect yellow. It doesn't get more yellow than that. And then we got purple. because it's the most like fire looking into the embers of fire I always love that sitting around a campfire just letting your eyes go out of focus functionality but that happened <laughs> still pretty cool light I like it although I don't know I still don't know how you make such a big mistake that's funny so that's about that guys thanks for watching I always appreciate your support sorry it took 10 minutes to open the box but Hopefully it helped you guys sleep, relax, focus in some sort of way. And I really appreciate all the kind words, all the support, all the comments, all the likes, and of course your subscriptions. You guys really help the channel grow. It's awesome. So get some sleep. And we'll see you next time. Right around. Bye guys.